Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, hey, what's up? My name's Louise, I make micro tutorials and I've now started vlogging. I vlog everything and blog everything, makeup related, lifestyle related, fashion, skincare, all of that jazz. So stick around, please subscribe. Um, I'll leave my blog in the description box and my Instagram so you can have a little nosy at that and see if you wanna join the craziness. Um, so today's video is going to be a vlog. I'm gonna vlog this week. I did a poll on my Instagram because I'm going to the NYX event tonight. Um, it's just a bloggers event in Leicester at the NYX count um, to try the new foundation, Won't Stop, Don't Stop, whatever it's called. Um, I'll find out more later. Um, so and people said yes, they'd watch it. So I thought, you know what? Content is content, let's vlog it. You'll probably see in this two weeks after the event because I've got my Marbella blog, vlog going up and then it'll be this. So yeah, I'll include a sip of my week. I hope you enjoy. <laughs> Whoa, that was a good catch. I was balancing my camera and somehow caught it. Woo! Let's not hope that is the start to my week. Um, so I've done my makeup on my lunch break. It is five to one. I'm gonna go get myself some lunch now. Um, I've gone for like a cranberry, smoky eye, slight wing, little blue eyeliner. Um, I put the wrong found it. Actually, it looks, it looks like it matches okay on camera. I use my Estee Lauder double wear in Desert Beige and it's a little bit too pale for my tan, even though my tan's fading. Um, so I had to really bronze up massively. So this is my makeup. Uh, I'm gonna do my hair just before the events and it's fresher and when I'm working and stuff I play with it. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this vlog. Please give it a thumbs up if you do enjoy it and yeah. do a quick haul from last night's NYX event. So we got a load of samples of the Ritual Body Moisturisers which I cannot wait to try because I've heard so many good reviews. Don't mind my little fluffy sock sticking in there. Um, let's pop those to the side so you can go in the bathroom. So let's get on to the makeup. So first thing first, which I literally cannot wait to play with this. Uh, this is the Contour Intuitive. Um, I'm so sorry, by the way, I'm still a little bit bunged up. So if I sound like a grizzly bear on steroids, I'm sorry. Um, so let's get this open. I mean, just look at that. Just look at that. I mean, come on, I'm loving this golden champagne -y. Again, excuse the nails, they really need to get done. This looks gorgeous. And I am loving this green and this amber. Wow, literally, I love this palette. I cannot wait to play with that. Literally, cannot wear it. So, we then had these beautiful autumnal shades blushes which are perfect for this time of year. Um, they are the pan ones that you buy and then pop into your palette. So I can't wait to try those. And then we have a few of the butter gloss ones. Um, we've got like a gorgeous coral shade uh, and then like a nudie pink shade. I have the more less pink nude, if you will, of these. And I love it, it's so pigmented and it's quite sticky. So if you don't like that in the lip gloss, um, you might not like these, but they are so, so pigmented. 
what I sometimes do is take them on my finger when I just want a little bit of colour and smear it on my lips. Um, makes it less intense, but gorgeous. Cannot wait to try this one. Then a beautiful red. And then I think I'm going, this is going to be my new fave. This is the soft um, matte lip cream in a gorgeous nude colour. And honestly, I think this is going to be my new fave. I will follow up with a review. So then we have three of the metallic range of the NYX Lingerie. Lingerie, I can't pronounce it. Um, these are, come on, focus. These are gorgeous, especially over like the Christmas period. Um, I saw so many people playing with them last year, um, but I was not quite brave enough to try them. So I cannot wait to give them a try this year. By the way, if things do say testers on, um, for example, this one says tester on, they are not actual testers that we've just taken off the shelf. Um, we were told that they were just the tester ones and um, the brand new ones. Um, they all had the thing on. So yeah, just ignore if they do say tester, reassure they're brand new ones and full actual products. Um, then we had the NYX uh, Liquid Suede. Um, this is a beautiful coral, cannot wait to try this. It's so pigmented and so bright. And you know how much I love my bright lip in summer. Then a purple one. Wow, do you know what? I actually can't wait to give this a go. Like just step out of my comfort zone. I think this is gonna be great for Halloween. So yeah. Then this, which I'm so excited to try, it's a MAC, uh, not a MAC, it's a matte lipstick and it's just a gorgeous, now you, how do I get it up, I think, or you push the end to get it up, that's quite cool, I think, okay it's hard to do one handed so that's a bit of a fail but I cannot wait to give that a go, and then lastly I have three of these, um, they're the Intense, Oh no, they're not. They're the Bright Idea Sticks. Um, they're like little chubby stick for contour and highlight. So I cannot wait to give this all this a go. Um, some of these, like this palette, I literally cannot wait to give a go. I'll probably do like a little makeup review um, later or tomorrow. Thank you so much, Sarah, for inviting me. And thank you, NYX Cosmetics. Um, for letting me attend your event. It was an amazing event. Loved seeing the demo and getting to play with makeup and this amazing little goodie bag. Hey guys, um, today is Friday, Friday. I think in my industry, or I don't know if other industries do this, on email it's, hey, such and such, happy Friday. So cringe, just be like, it's Friday, are you glad? The answer is going to be yes. Have a lovely weekend. I'm not a big fan of this whole happy Friday thing. Maybe I'm being miserable, but. So I want to hop, hop on here to basically show you, I think this is going to be my palette of dreams. This is the Revolution Pro Regeneration Gold Mine. This was eight pounds. Look at those shades. I mean, this is just beautiful. This is like a whole load of expensive, like the Anastasia Beverly Hills and uh, the Urban Decay. That they look like they're all just mushed together. And I mean, I haven't tried it yet, so I'm going to try it. So that's why I'm going to fill my makeup. Um, sorry, I'm out. I'm also working. I have my laptop here whilst doing my makeup because it's life. So I wanted to basically record my makeup so I could show you this and how we get on and I'll probably, if you want, leave me a comment and I'll film a tutorial using this, doing an out of the ordinary makeup look or a makeup look you'd like to see. Um, but I also wanted to use some of the NYX products that I got from the event. Um, I've chosen a few that I'll perhaps play around with. Um, I'll try and incorporate this. Um, so yeah, just thought I'd film my makeup and getting ready and let's see goes on excuse my hair I need to do it somewhere I'm actually going out on my lunch break um for a couple of hours to take some photos for my Instagram because since coming off holiday I've got like no content so yeah <laughs> So you have to be quite rigorous with the blending of the, um, the, the bright, I think the bright idea 
contour sticks. Now it has got a little bit of shimmer in. Um, so that colour is quite nice. Now I'm only putting a tiny bit of my base on because I'm going to do my eyes, but I just wanted to test these out. Okay, that's nice. Yep, yeah, I like that. I mean, it doesn't compare to the Becca Champagne Pop, but I like that. Mm hmm. I like that. My lips are so dry, so I'm taking some Bepanthane. Yes, this is Nafirash cream. It gives a nice white tint because I have slabbing my lips in it. But honestly, it's so good. When I was on Rakuten, it's the only thing I'd use to like, that would actually sort my lips out. I'm really impressed with the products I've used and this eyeshadow palette from Revolution Wowzers, it's amazing Let me know down in the comments if you'd like to see this makeup tutorial It was super easy and quite fast I've done this whole makeup look in 20 minutes So <laughs> So I see we spot this burning around here and then this was a light, the sun came onto this and this is a light so I have to put that out. Hey guys, so I thought I would quickly vlog, um, have a little catch up, it is Sunday, we have got back, I'm really sorry if this is really dark, um, we've just got back from a little family walk, we all went, um, took the kids um, to a little park near us, had a bit of a kick around, Dan's watching the golf. And clearly commentating very loudly. Um, so I've just been for a little walk around the park, just give the football a kick around. Um, now me, my mum and dad and Dan, we are going to go out for some Sunday lunch. We're going to a little place in Bloodworth. Um, apparently it's really nice, so we'll see. I just quickly chuck some makeup on and um, did my hair. I just wanted to talk about this NYX. Um, it's the super cliquey matte lipstick um, it's in the colour Empowered oh, that's cool that Empowered Women and I love it it's just the perfect autumn shade I just feel like that we've had a proper Sunday like Sundays to me are a walk again a bit of fresh air wrapping up getting like your winter warm is on and then um, having a proper Sunday lunch just feels like a proper Sunday to me. Better. That's better, isn't it? That's why I just love this. It's like a berry shade. I think it's gorgeous. I'm absolutely loving it right now. Just a really simple eye. Um, so yeah, just waiting for mum and dad to come pick us up. Very nice. What's this, isn't it? Yep. Get back, have another bottle of wine. Yeah, good idea. 
that's better, but you can see all my mess. Okay, there's worse things to happen. Hey guys, good morning. Today is Monday and it's the 1st of October. Um, I'm probably going to wrap my vlog up here. Um, uh, my good God, am I feeling autumnal? Last night we had the fire on for the first time. 30th of September, note that Danny Diaries, major news. I put the fire on. It was only on for approximately half an hour, but that bad boy went on. I had my firesides, candle lighting. Oh, it smelled gorgeous. Um, so I just thought I'd start the vlog. I'm in my office. I've got myself a cup of green tea. I'm looking a little bit worse for wear today, but we're gonna go past that. It's a Monday. Um, and I was just actually posting on my company's Instagram. Um, Smart Click Digital, if you guys want to go give us a little follow. Um, if you want to find out more about affiliate marketing or performance marketing, um, give us a follow and join the journey with me. Let's focus that again. Um, got myself a green tea. Uh, I wanted to just document that last month was my best month on record so far and I'm really proud of myself. I don't know how because I literally was barely at work. I had two weeks off on holiday, I had a week off being poorly and then I had a load of meetings and appointments and to me it's impressive. So um, yeah, um, I had a really, really like good night's sleep but weird night's sleep. But you know when you have a dream, then you wake up and you're like, okay, that felt real. Like You know it's not real. But you were that deep in it and then you wake up from your dream and then you go back to sleep in your dream and what well, I hate that weird feeling the next no I'm not a fan of that so um today is a Monday and it's full of Monday jobs I need to at some point get my nails done um I think I might actually have a pamper day on Saturday oh so you won't have actually seen my home sense haul yet because that's going up after this but oh my god Here's one of the reasons why you should watch it. So we're shopping and we're looking at all the Halloween sections and I smell this burning, like a burning, not of like a vapour or a cigarette, a burning. I was like, what is that smell? So I see little stuffed teddy bears pour on fire. So I was like, whoa. So we put it on the floor, dampened it on the floor and stamped on it. Um, and basically the sun from, it was that, it was that bright sunshine, it came through, hit the snow globe cause a fire you know how science work I don't need to help explain how that works to you um so I was like right I better tell someone because this this could happen again so I told the lady at the till and then we was looking on the can they had a massive candle section it was like my heaven it was amazing I even Dan got into it like he was lifting it was amazing it was a fabulous after Sunday Saturday afternoon um so the manager came in to she was like you've just saved the store you're gonna have 20% off I was like decent that's gonna add up um, so I was going crazy on the candles anyway then because I knew I was getting a little bit off I was a little bit more crazy and then I actually spent I think it was something like £98 but I got it for like £78 on candles that's ridiculous to watch my haul which will be up next week so if you don't you have not already subscribed you should subscribe because then you won't miss the video and then you'll get to see the fact that I had practically saved the store from going on fire and I bought a ton of candles.